everyone, so today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a 3D building using Ultimate Doom Builder. So to start, I'm going to be basically making like a platform. This is where I'm going to put the building. I can make it about this big. Then I'm going to raise it up so that it's more like a building. You do this, of course, on a much larger scale. And I can change the texture to, let's go with... B stone one and change the top texture to flat five five. All right. So now what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to make some stairs. B stone, copy paste. So there, that works, right? So I'm going to make this like a bit bigger because it's supposed to be normally done on a pretty big scale. Although since this is on a small building, we're not going to do that kind of scale. So what we can do is scale this up so that it'll fit. And then we can change this texture to the door texture. And now we can select all of these textures to change them to whatever we want them to be. Uh, how about there? So there. So we have that. So this is our setup, right? Now we want to make this. This is going to be a teleporting line. Basically, what this teleporting line is going to do is it's going to teleport you between the room that has the fake door, which is just the door texture, and the room that actually has the real door to make it seem 3D. What we're going to want to do is set that to the action number 244, which is a repeatable walking thing, which is walking repeatable teleport to the line with the same tag which is silent and contains the same angle now we're going to want to copy everything here and paste it right outside of it so you can't see any of them from the other and then we're going to want to delete this and now these two are going to have to have the same tag so we'll just have that be one and have this be the opposite so you go through here and then you end up this way all right now what we want to do is drag the ceilings here downwards got to mention this but you only need to drag this one and this one downwards so you don't actually need to drag this downwards and you can just replace the texture with whatever you want uh like i can do g stone here so like this so that way, from here, you're not going to be able to see it, and you'll teleport to here, which will be seamless. So now, in here, what we're going to want to do is we're going to change this, extend it out, basically, and then I can take this and make like some points here so that it extends out into an actual area, and then you can drag it upwards so that it fits. And then you can change the textures of all of this to something like, how about we go with, again, G-Stone, right? Unfortunately, I accidentally made the floor up there so I can drag this down. And there, that should completely work. So if we play it, you'll see it's completely 3D. Although there are some missing textures here because I accidentally did that. And it's completely seamless. Although you do have to have that for the door to actually work. But other than that, it's completely seamless. And it looks and feels like it's a 3D building. So that's basically all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it, and I'll see you next time.